East and see Tampa Bay continues. Uh, welcome back to the show. Before we leave you, though, today, you know, typically these two are the ones that are heading out to, to do all of the fun. But I finally had a chance to explore one of Florida Aquarium's habitats from the inside of the habitat. The best part, you can do it too. Take a look. Oh, we just had such a great time at the Florida Aquarium, the Sea Trek experience. I was able to handle it, and I gotta tell you, I've never done anything like that before. I'm back with my friend Chris, and Chris, just being able to overall see this experience, what do people out there need to know about it, and why should they sign up? Well, this is a 20-minute, fully immersed experience. Your hair gets to stay dry. You can wear your glasses if you want. Uh, you'd be 10 or older, no need to know how to swim and do it, and you can find more information at flaquarium.org. By the way, we just got out of the habitat there. I mean, we were seeing so many different stingrays. Did I even see a shark in there? And the turtle, we got to say. That was, like, my favorite part. Yeah, we have our loggerhead sea turtle, Sheldon. We have two bonnethead sharks and our nurse shark. And you really do feel like you are one with the fish. And you touched on the hair stays dry. I can uh, attest to that right here. I've got the messy bun. But I was a little insecure about the whole breathing because I don't know how to scuba dive. But that didn't stop me at all. And really, the way the helmet works, you get that natural oxygen. Yeah, if you can breathe on land, you can breathe underwater just fine. I was able to do it and again we had such a great experience. You too can do this. You and your family, the Florida Aquarium, go to their website or as always just go to Taste and C's website as well. There you go. I gotta tell you, like I was a little nervous. You guys heard me oh, talking sure. yeah. before I did it. It was so much fun. I had no reason to be nervous at all. Literally, yeah. the age is 10 and up, and anybody can do it. No swimming required. No worrying about breathing. That's what I was always <laughs> concerned with. No worrying about that. You actually it makes it very easy, and, and you even you can like put your hand up and like touch your face, oh, and the wow. water still doesn't go up. It's crazy. Yeah, because that's the thing that tripped me up. Because I I don't swim. I don't. You don't, <laughs> I don't need to. You don't need diving. to. So it was a pretty you know easy seamless experience is what it seems like. 110 percent. I mean, in fact, you know, you put it on. The only thing that was a little it kind of unusual is you have to depressurize as you're taking each step down, but they've got such a wonderful staff. They explain everything. Again, it really is a special experience. Cool. Anybody 10 and up can do it. Just go to the website for the Florida Aquarium to find out more. I love it. And speaking of the Florida Aquarium, they're undergoing a $40 million yes. expansion, meaning there's even more fun coming to the aquarium. The project will include a rotating special exhibit gallery, converting the second floor lobby into a multi-species gallery, and a large-scale outdoor exhibit exhibit featuring California sea lions, which cool. will be the very first time you'll be able to see them on the west coast of Florida. And this will be the first major expansion of the Florida Aquarium since it opened in 1995. This will be a three phase project starting in January of 2023 and finishing in 2025. And I cannot wait. Yeah. How exciting. So happy for yes. That. All right. Well, now to the drone zone. We are taking flight at the Oxford Exchange, a one stop shop for brunch, drinks and shopping in Tampa. Now, my favorite spot has to be the champagne pain bar there, but you can definitely grab some delicious food, check out maybe that some glasses at Warby Parker, or even take a look around the bookstore. There's certainly stuff work, uh, worth checking out right there. And of course, for more information, just head on over to our website at tasteandseetampabay.com. Well, that is going to do it for today's show. Thank you so much for being with us. I hope everybody has a good long weekend, right? Yes. Happy, Labor we Day Happy Labor Day weekend, everybody. Have a good one.